The next aspect I'd like to address is the assumption that property investing is all about capital growth. Well, it can be, and capital growth is a wonderful, quite often a byproduct of a, a well-positioned portfolio. But for, for most of the students and for myself, and, and I know I can speak on behalf of Roger as well, our portfolio is designed for cash flow. Maybe capital growth it will come in time and, and, and that's likely. But our positioning and our strategy isn't about that. And quite often people make the assumption that um, you know, you're investing in property to, to see an uplift and then, um, and then have that capital sat uh, maybe to flip on and, and, and realize down the line. Well, that's gambling the market. You know, we, we don't play it so that the market is gonna go up. We expect it to and all the, all the indicators will suggest it will. But that isn't the strategy that we currently uh, apply. And, and so the, the myth we'd like to dispel is that property investing is all about the capital growth um, because it just isn't. One of the other things we hear a lot is property investing is too much hassle. And I find this one interesting and uh, I think it comes out of maybe you've met somebody who's got a property portfolio or maybe just a buy to let and they've had some hassle with a tenant or... And I, I, this, the reason I find it surprising is that um, one of the things on the courses and one of the things we deploy is, is, having, uh, is having that strong team around you, having that power team in place, including the management team who manages the property on a day-to-day -day basis. So you're not involved in that. Um, yes, some of the decision-making through an email or a phone call to keep the thing going in the right direction, but the day-to-day -day hassle actually, I, I believe, is very low indeed. Uh, the buying process, you know, there could be some form filling and and, and some um, you know some paperwork to be done. But essentially, if you get this right, it's a low hassle kind of passive income. So that's the reason why we'd like to dispel the myth of property investing being too much hassle. Something else we hear from time to time is when people say um, it's too late. You know, I should have done it in my 20s or in my 30s or whatever. Well, the truth is uh, a, a property can be cash flowing from day one. You know, there are properties out there that will give you a return from the very moment you complete that purchase. I have a tenant in place. Um, property investing absolutely can be in the here and now. It's definitely not a get rich quick solution but I do believe that it can apply to people who have a pension pot they want to um, position or aspire to an earlier retirement or at a time in their life when maybe they think they might have missed the boat, but it just couldn't be further from the truth. So the, uh, the myth that we'd like to dispel is this idea that um, you, you've missed the boat, it's too late and, and uh, wish you'd done it years ago.